Hi guys. Rainy day today, as you can hear. Still waiting for some parts to try and repair this uh, power unit for the 200 LED light string. I have had a look online at these CZJUTAI power units. They are available. They're about £18, the ones I can see on eBay, which is quite a crazy price, to be honest. Bearing in mind, this light string only cost £12 originally, although that was probably a good few years ago. Anyway, in Poundland again today, and I spotted these. 100 multicolour light string, mains operated, indoor and outdoor. 8 multifunction, £6 these cost me. I am actually thinking of using them outdoors because our Christmas lights that we put um, outdoors have got several strings of them and some of them are 40. Uh, so, I thought we'd give them a try. These are um, got a secure screw on plug fixing, but they're still just two wire, the same as this one's just two wire. And I did wonder whether this would die instantly if we plugged it into the light string for there. This one. Secondary, 31 volts, uh, lamps, 31 volts, 0 to 6 watts. It doesn't just give us a simple amperage output for that. But, this one, it's exactly the same sequence of operation. Can you hold that so the light can on there? Combination, in waves, sequential, slow go, sorry, slow glow, chasing flash, slow fade, twinkle flash, steady on, which is exactly the same as we get on this one, and it's in smaller writing. Combination in waves, sequential, slow glow, chasing flash, slow fade, twinkle flash, steady on. Oh, it's gone a bit quieter now. This one's got the button on the top here, as opposed to the button just there, which we don't want to lose. Um, I could split this one apart and have a look inside, but at the moment I don't want to. I will just plug it in so we can see it operating, and then I might just rig up a temporary feed and see if we can run these off it. If it draws too much current, that will overheat and probably shut itself down. I doubt that it will actually catch fire, but that's always a possibility, isn't it? That one says 3.5 volt AC, LED driver, S. ELV IP20. Oh, that's interesting. But it actually tells you. Yeah. SELV IP20. We've got SELV IP20 written on them. Anyway, we'll plug this one in. And you should always unwind them, but we'll just go for it anyway. Okay. Slow flash.
Is that going to go through the whole sequence? Yeah, faster flash. Faster flash. Faster flash. Because when they're set out in a string, that will be a different effect. And that's back to slow flash. I didn't see permanent on. Let's see if we can step through them. That looks to me like slow fade. Yeah, that's slow fade. Okay, next. What's that supposed to be? Sort of chasing flash. Yeah, you really can't tell unless they're actually strung out in a string. Twinkle flash. No, nope, that looks like that looks like steady on to me. Oh no. Hmm. Okay, well, we've gone through the sequence. I can't honestly say that I could match those to, what was it? Combination in wave, sequential, slow glow, chasing flash, slow fade, twinkle flash, steady on. I and mean, that appears to be the steady on state now anyway. So, it works. And what I'm gonna try and do is rig up some printing temporary and see if we can run the 200 string off it what do you think do you think that'll blow up do you think they just won't work don't know how are we going to do this jam a couple of wires in there i could cut that and put on some JST connectors, the one I use on the model cars and aeroplanes and boats. And that would probably be absolutely fine. And then I could rig something up on that one too. But I think what I'll do is I'll just try and jam some wires in there to link them together. Right, rain's gone off a bit. The message is, don't try this at home. Although we should be safe, this side of the transformer, mains that side, this side, um, what did it say? I think it said 3.7 volts. So we should be safe, but um, don't try this at home. Right, I've rigged up a connector that will connect to the outside and inside of that plug and then if I just shove it in there I will just demonstrate this is working first yeah so works with a hundred LEDs but if we stick it in here we are definitely not running the 200 LEDs uh, bearing in mind that also that one's supposed to be 30 volts and this one is 3.7 volts. It's not really surprising it doesn't work, but I had to give it a try. 
So um, no further forwards at fixing the uh, 200 LED st string. Still waiting for the bits to arrive for that. And we have got ourselves a 100 LED string that I can use to replace the ones that are faulty in our Christmas stock that go out at the front of the house. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel, and down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.